Okay, we are trying out lovely assistance today. <laughs> Hence the new hands on the bird, which just gives me a chance to be a cameraman. All right. <clears throat> um, okay, this guy was a girl. was actually brought in this morning. It is first thing Monday morning, and we have this large lump here. I have cleaned it up. As you can see, there is a small line going through the center here. After I was gloved up, I actually went and made a small incision to see what was beneath it. This is not an abscess, but it's some kind of large mass. So I'm going to swab it in a second, put a sample under the microscope, and take chicken back to mom and dad when I do some diagnostics. In the meantime, we have a peek of a look at too, but uh, this is just greater than a year old chicken, <clears throat> and that is not normal. No, it is not. Okay. So thank you, lovely assistant. Give us a thumbs up. <laughs> Very good. I can, when I post it on the farm page, I'll okay. Okay. Do you need me to get a get it so you can get a better picture of it? No, she's doing fine. She's just okay. walking around. Timing is pretty natural. Hey, pose now. Okay, <laughs> work it, baby. <laughs> Give her some scratch and she will. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it is Monday morning. We have this greater than a year old female chicken here. Um, if you will notice again, again, this in the back, there's that mass right there. I have actually tried cleaning it up and uh, thinking it was going to be a small mass or an abscess on the inside. Maybe it was in front of abscess. So you plus cam uh, fans, nope, it's not going to work for you today. Anyway, I uh, kept cleaning it up, found an area where I a sample from the inside, and then I have actually spent the last 20 or 30 minutes on the microscope trying to figure out what's going on. All right, what makes this case a little bit on the complicated side is that tumor right there, uh, or the mass, we won't call it a tumor just yet, actually has both bacterial elements in it and fungal elements. But because of the way that it is not walled off, I am hedging away from a bacterial abscess and heading more toward a, uh, a fungal growth. So to uh, make sure that we're not missing anything, we're going to send them with an antibiotic and an antifungal. It'll be a once a day dose because I like these guys. Um, they have since taken pictures of me with the chicken. <laughs> Which I cannot wait to see what that looks like. Um, and we will have to see how this works. So I expect in a week these, this lump to be much smaller. Okay. Uh, in the meantime, just some warm comp compresses, keeping it clean. Should probably speed and expedite that a little bit better. Any questions? No? None? Nothing? Hey, should be happy Monday. Yes. <laughs> All right. Later.